Hiya and welcome back to Fox's Fabulous World Where I am not in creative mode Which I'm not gonna jump down there with And today is the day of the daunting triathlon. That's right. Everything's set up. Now, I've gone with... Right, we'll get some food first, just in case. Yes, because I need to replenish my hunger. Uh, I've gone with a different approach to the fences. I haven't fenced it all off. I have no idea where my food is. Where is it? Here it is. Oh, yes. Dumped in with among the other rubbish that I have. Um... Do I have any cooked food? No, well, other than bread. And I don't think bread's gonna cut this, is it? Oh, no, it doesn't go away. Oh, it, oh, it should do, it should do, just about. Right, okay. Well, we are gonna need to take some food, so we get some uh, pork chops in the furnace, I think. There's, there we go, that's away. <coughs> I, thought really, I, I like that little texture there. So, right, so we should wait for these. <coughs> um, yes, I don't know if you can see it from the house, right? I have turned mobs off. Because mob grief, and there you go, you should be able to see it just straight in front of us. As you can see, I have just fenced up around the corners, same way down here as well. Obviously, that's a little different compared to over there. Because um, it saves, it's wasting wood. You fence off the whole thing, it's just gonna, you might as well put racing cars down on it. Although, that would be a good mod. Uh, for Minecraft, uh, anyone, if uh, you want to try to build a good mod for me to use, and yeah, go ahead. Um, yeah, <coughs> um, but yeah, so because it would it would be unnecessary because it's it, you know you've got a straight line going there. You, you're gonna know where you want to go. Why would you fence it off? It's stupid. So it made no sense logically. So well, you know that that house does look groovy. That's not even finished yet. That is not too bad at all. Right, uh, hopefully the pork chops are cooked. Got most of them. Yes, they are. There we go. Oh, that's a nice. Oh, I like that. It doesn't move, but it looks all right. It's a good texture, that. Okay. See, I'm going to be saying that for like the next 20 episodes because there's loads of things. I mean, I haven't even visited the Nether, so I have no idea what that's going to look like. <laughs> We all know that the nether is literally hell on Minecraft Earth, but, um, yeah. <coughs> so this is it, this is the uh, the triathlon. I uh, will get the timer at the ready very soon. Oh, the squid's about, this is not going to end well. <coughs> Have I got armor? Oh yes, I've got iron armor, haven't I, here? I keep forgetting about that. Oh dear. And I still haven't put steps here. Why? Oh lord, well, it, it doesn't matter too much. It's, it's okay. Right, so the rules are simple. Remember, we have... The first part of the triathlon is the boat race. You go around to the finish line. You pick up two potions of swiftness. So I got that right. And then you pick up two splash potions of swiftness. And yeah, uh, then you have to run around the entire track all the way once. And then half, so you end up back here. <coughs> and then that is where you will swim. And while I think about it, guys, you know what? The one thing I have not done... Which I shall build over here. <coughs> we'll put it here. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Okay, come on, come on. Pick it up. Because. Get rid of that. Oh, no, no, no. Right, there we go. Okay, right. Because. Remember the rules. If you still have any of your uh, swiftness potion left after the run, bef uh, yeah, before the swim, uh, yeah, before the swim, you will have to go into the holding area here. Wait for it to wear off. Now, if there's say three, four, maybe five seconds left, 
you could probably get away with going there and then you could start straight away which will be fine that'll be okay <coughs> um, but obviously and the rules at the end is while you're swimming you cannot uh, finish the race while you have any swiftness potion available or splash potion <coughs> should I say because that is uh, that's what you use for the final part right and you only get three boats I'm gonna go with three I'll be cautious about it as well there we go there's my three boats right <coughs> and uh, that is pretty much it for the rules so we have the boat the run and the swim and the annoying squids that are probably gonna end up destroying my boats so we should be good in five four three two one go right now uh, we are in come on come on there we go we're away we're away right now you gotta take this nice and cautiously because it is quite narrow over here okay we're away <coughs> Oh, we are flying, we're flying, we're doing pretty okay. Oh no, we broke the boat, broke the boat, broke the boat, come on. In, 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 get in the boat. Damn you, chicken. Okay. No, 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 no. I don't want to really destroy the chicken. Come on. We're coming up to a minute, well, coming up to 45 seconds, nearly a minute already. Slow down, slow down. Okay, we've got. We're going with the narrow way. This is uh, quite tricky. Oh, we broke the last boat. Okay, well we should be okay. <coughs> right, we're away. We're going. We're going. We're sailing. We're we'll go. We are flying. Here we go. Come on, come on. I keep forgetting I'm in creative mode. I didn't mean to be in creative mode when I started. Well, okay, the third bro boat has broken, so you have to swim all the way back. Okay, let's just ditch some of these boats because uh, I, I have no need for them. Right, we need. Oh, no, shift click. Right, okay. So move you along there, get you there. Shift click, shift click, there we go, okay. Right, so we are away again and we have the no it's the push of swiftness, you need a drink. And we are away, okay, so now I've got to bear in mind that is only one. Because <coughs> I am still in creative mode, I can't believe I forgot to change back. So you'll get a look at the uh, fences as well. Uh, see, see there you go, blocked off. Use the tree there to block it off as well anyway, so I kept that as it was. Pretty much the same there, you go around here, there we go. We're away, We've got to sprint again. Okay, see that's where the tree comes in handy there as well. We're away again. Keep going, keep going. Now comes the tricky bit. Right, left, right, left, right. And that's a long, long stretch now. Go over the bridge. Get out of the way, chicken. And down. Okay, we're going round. Still going. Okay, now here comes another tricky bit here. You gotta go. Come on. Right, we should drink the other potion of swiftness now. It's probably a bit of a mistake, but if I could time it right, it should be okay. It is getting dark, but that's not a problem, because mobs are off, so we should be alright. To the right, come on. Go, go, go. Push, push, push. We're not doing too badly for time. We're coming up to four minutes. <coughs> Get out of the way!
Okay, this has worked pretty well, pretty well. <clears throat> I think I might have overdone it a little with the swiftness potion. I maybe we'll just about get to the other bridge. I don't know because obviously I don't want to check because it's all been time now. Okay, come on, here we go, here we go. We're not going to have long, I'd say if anything, we've probably got another 10 seconds left on the swiftness. Swiftness? Swiftness. Come on, go, go, go. Okay, well, we are going to have to check very soon because if there is still something there, then we will have to wait. So the question is will I pay the penalty or not? I think I will. I don't think it's worn off. Oh, oh! I might be lucky, has it? Yes, it's worn off. Right, so we can go straight for the swim. We'll get the old uh, splash potion ready. Right. <coughs> well, that wasn't too bad for timing. That was pretty alright. If I left it a few seconds longer, it could have been better. Right, we'll go straight in for the swim. Did I get that? Yes, I got that. Okay, right, that's good. I'm not sure if it has any uh, any effect anyway, but I, I don't know. I suppose psychologically it could help you out, you know, mentally. Squid, you get in my way, you will get killed. Right, now I think this time we'll go the shortest route, but one of the trickiest routes, which is the tunnel. Okay, I don't have long left. Let's get another one on the go. That's good, come on. <coughs> Alright, gotta keep pushing, gotta keep pushing. Come on, come on, there we go. Right, okay, we're at the tunnel, we've got through the tunnel. We're nearly at the home stretch, we're nearly at the home stretch, right. We have come up to 6 minutes and 35 seconds so far. <coughs> Keep going, keep going. Right, uh, right. I think I've just run out of sweat. No, I haven't. What the what on earth happened there then? That was rather weird. Anyway, yeah, come on, keep pushing. I've still got a load of time. Come on. Seven minutes fifteen. Keep going. Right, so my potion has run out. What are you doing? Don't stop. <coughs> Seven minutes thirty odd. Come on. Gotta make sure we get across that finish line. Seven minutes and 46 seconds there we have it so that is now going to be my record to beat whenever I play this again 7 minutes and 46 so well, that wasn't too bad that wasn't too bad to be honest bear in mind the first attempt it was more of a clart around you know uh, I apologize for not being out creative mode either I didn't mean to actually go back out I really did but I forgot all about it and luckily enough, I didn't have to use any of the uh, penalty platforms, which is uh, is okay. So, um, yeah, that was finally, at last, the triathlon. And the, uh, I built it around, literally, this is all natural. I, I haven't made any of this whatsoever. This is what was here, you know, down by this hillside. Um, so I just kind of went around and... Sometimes obviously carved tunnels into the land, but other than that, this is all natural. So I've gone around the land really, and I think it's it's pretty good. <coughs> I mean, 
if anything this would be the quickest route it, it is tricky I suppose if you could line it up right you could maybe just maybe if you lined that up dead right you can maybe easily blitz through there well, I suppose it could be doable couldn't it well, so you've got this last block, so you've got this last block here that would get in the way. But if you're quick enough, you could easily swing it around. So, yeah, so there we go, triathlon. 7 minutes 46. Not too shabby at all. I'm, I'm chuffed with that. So, right, well, let me know if you want um, if you want to make it a bit interesting. Let me know if you want mobs turned on for the next video. And I will do it at night. And we'll see how that goes. It's probably going to end up absolutely horribly in disaster. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll be up to that challenge. If you want me to do that, then hit the like button. Uh, or you can leave a comment below as well. Uh, let me know. Right. Well, guys, there is uh, only one thing left for me to say. And that is... You have been watching. And I will see you all later. Bye!